exposes its contents is finally out. It's called Laptop from Hell, Hunter Biden, Big Tech, and the Dirty Secrets the President, President, tried to hide. It is available now. The one and only Miranda Devine joins us as well. Miranda, congratulations on the book. Uh, it has rightfully been front of, and center because of some of the revelations that you provide having gone through this laptop, which is verified to be Hunter Biden's. What are people going to learn here? Thanks, Pete. Well, look, I think a few things are surprising uh, and people may not know how close Hunter Biden was, for instance, to the olig uh, Russian oligarchs that are in the inner sanctum of Vladimir Putin's court. And in fact, there was one day when um, Hunter Biden had lunch, a State Department lunch hosted by his father for uh, the now uh, president of China, Xi Jinping. And then he hopped on a plane and flew to Moscow to have breakfast the next day at the home of one of these oligarchs. So mm. he was a very tight with people who were pretty shady characters. I mean, he went to one, one time to Lake Como to a very um, illustrious uh, sort of oligarch hotel there on the shore called Villa de Este, and he was hobnobbing with various Wall Street titans and oligarchs, including uh, a woman, Russia's uh, richest woman, uh, a woman by the name of Elena Baturina. He met her there with his friend Devin Archer, and this was just a few weeks after, six weeks after Elena Baturina had wired $3.5 million hmm. into a bank account associated with Devin Archer, who was Hunter Biden's partner. So to be clear, this was not Donald Trump Jr. meeting with Russian oligarchs. This was <laughs> Hunter Biden. Uh, we, we could get into content. We don't have enough time to get into it. I know we, I, I remember the excerpt in the New York Post about the communist Chinese and their connections. It's, it's incredible. But what was it like to actually read all of these emails and go through it? Oh, look, I mean, it's a labyrinth. There are tens of thousands of documents, and every time you, you do a deep dive, you end up down some rabbit hole or other. Um, but, I mean, occasionally I would just push myself away from the desk after hours and just shake my head and say, I cannot believe I just read that. Um, and when you piece together that puzzle with Tony Bobolinsky, who was a partner of Hunter Biden, all his WhatsApp messages that I have, uh, and then on top of that, the Johnson Grassley Senate inquiry, which had all those suspicious activities, transactions that came from the Treasury Department, from the bank accounts and bank wires that went to uh, entities associated with Hunter Biden. It adds up to tens of millions of dollars and really America's national interest um, compromised. Wow. Well, thanks for doing the homework, doing the work that no one else in the media was willing to do. And for everyone's sake, I hope it's also not a picture book because that could be mortifying. I'm um, Brandon Devine. Thank you so much. <laughs> Appreciate it.